me now san konnichiwa welcome back to my channel after so so long <laughs> how are you guys doing i've missed you i've missed this channel i've missed everything about this <laughs> it's been a hot minute i know there's been a lot going on guys um and i have a little announcement to make but not right now right now we're getting to unboxing final fantasy 7 rebirth it has been a hot minute since i've been on this channel streamed played anything unboxed anything um ff16 still looms waiting to be completed that is a story for another day though today we get to unboxing final fantasy 7 rebirth those of you that know me and know this channel for final fantasy 7 and i it's a love story thing like it's a full-on love story forever and ever began so many years ago when i was a kid loved that game fell in love with it have always been in love with it so ff7 rebirth is a huge deal to me i'm so obsessed so of course i got the collector's edition um and it's right here right next to my legs it's giant though this box is bigger than me guys one useless piece of cardboard bubble wrap oh my gosh final fantasy rebirth the deluxe edition version of the game uh, okay but couldn't this say collector's edition though because like this is technically technically the collector's edition okay wait hold on it says defy destiny together at the back will we though will we we shall find out okay look in it there's like four different things okay so we have final fantasy rebirth okay ah, look at this steel case with the crowd and zach oh my gosh my loves the art of final fantasy 7 rebirth a sneak peek a quick peek oh damn look at the page we landed on it is fate destiny seven seconds till the end and all that shit yeah 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 you know you know the drill okay there's this to like how's it in how's this in this is the ff7 rebirth mini soundtrack who has cd players anymore is that just me? Does anybody have like actually own one? Shouldn't this be vintage now? I don't own a CD player. How am I going to play this? Mm, okay, we'll find out about that. <laughs> but anyway, this is housed in there in that little slot there. I am extremely flipping excited, guys. I cannot explain. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm coming back to gaming and I'm coming back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Of all things, you guys know me. You guys know I love Final Fantasy VII so much. This is the game of all games for me as a child growing up. It shaped me in so many different ways. My character, my love for gaming. Here we are. She's perfect. Okay. Okay. Oh, yes, I remember this. So it's like two discs, isn't it? One's data disc. Okay, one's the actual play disc. I'm so flipping excited. This is amazing. No! Okay, okay, okay. We have a giant Sephiroth in here. You don't understand. Like, this is what... This is what Rosie dreams of. <laughs> you don't? It says... Fragile. Skrenix Predix. And then it says... Final Fantasy Seven Static Gods! Yeah! <laughs> Sephiroth! Oh, I'm so excited! You don't understand. This is amazing! Oh my gosh, I think I might lose it. Okay, wait. Oh my lord, Jesus. Can you let me in though? Wait, why are you... Okay. Here we go. Okay, wait. I'll do another one over here. She is secured, peeps. Let me tell you. Right now. She has been secured. God damn, you think Genova's head is in here or something? It's only Sephiroth. Lord Jesus. Let the geezer go. Let him be free. I can't open it. This is ridiculous. Don't don't comment anything about that. Be quiet, guys. I know you think of things. Okay. Okay. Another useless piece of cardboard. Just take it away. A useless whatever this is. A piece of paper. Whoa. This is crazy. Wait, I don't want to break things. Oh crap, this is big. Oh man. Am I going to handle this box or is it going to handle me? Whoa. 
This is massive. Oh my days. I think I need a tissue. My nose has started running and everything. This is like, this is a lot. You, <laughs> you've seen the size of this box though, right? If this figure comes out and it's that big, somebody's getting hurt. Somebody. I'm get, I'm writing a strong letter. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody's gonna hear words from me. They're gonna be strong words. I'm telling you now. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay, wait, wait. Okay, wait, guys. Look! Ah, you're showing me! It's just another box and unbox, so I'm so excited because I'm one step closer. I can't believe I'm this close to Sephiroth. Okay. Finally. Hey, guys. <gasps> Whoa! Literally headless Sephi. Can you guys see that? There's his head and his hair just floating around in there with one wing. Bro, that's as big as my head. <laughs> that's substantial, fam. <laughs> that's as big as my head. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you now, his face is perfect. And his wing is perfect. And the top of him... This, like, top of the torso bit. Oh, is that an arm? What is that? Oh, it's the other little wing. Okay, wait. I need to, like, put pieces to the side because there's a lot happening here. What is this? A guitar pick? I don't know. Oh, is he wedged in there? I don't know to... <gasps> Oh, what the flip? Guys, this is layers. Look. Wait. I need to chuck this down for a second. Oh my god, his sword is massive! Yo, I need to be careful. Can you see? The sword is like the length of this box. Guys, the box is huge. The sand is like kind of a little bit lame looking, but we'll see. <laughs> Whoa! Are you joking? This is sick! Headless Sephi! <laughs> Wait, let's put his head on! Man's is headless! Wait, he needs a head! Give him, give this man a neck! Man needs a neck, shit! Oh lord! Stop it! Yo! This is sick, fam! This is stupid! Bro, I would have been happy with just this alone! The attention to detail, are you joking? He's so perfect. He's literally perfect. Would it be wrong to put him next to Aeris, though? On my shelf! Yo, I'm not taking the I'm not taking the piss, I promise. I just... Like, would it be wrong, though? Okay, next bit is the sword. Let's get his sword out. Look at the sword. The sword perfectly is perfectly longer than him. They thought of everything, guys. Hey, wait. I'm gonna just say this now so that everybody understands. The Final Fantasy 16 collector's edition was not worth it. That little figure was really not that worth it. This is a next level beauty. This is worth collector's edition money, guys. I'm telling you now. 100%. 100%. Yes. All of it. All of it. Yes. You have to pop this bit off. Which bit comes off? Let me see. I don't want to break it. It says you remove the end piece. This is so perfect, guys. I can't explain. This is actually amazing. Are you joking? Oh my gosh, guys, this looks sick. I guess you can point it whichever way you want, but considering like the flames, the reflection of the flames are on the bottom edge of the sword, I put it facing that way. I can poke my eyes out with this. Sephiroth's about to do damage. He's about to KO my eye. This is the stand. Okay. That looks like the right way. Guys. This is like a mammoth. Do you know what this is missing? Lights. Like, 
putting lights under this would just look so sick. i to remove the head to assemble the wings. Okay, so we got to remove his head. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Sephiroth. One of these comes off. One of the panels on here. This side? Guys, this is a whole operation. Ooh. It literally came out with this guitar pick thing. Okay, so the back panel of his back, let me show you before I poke my eye out, comes off. Can you see the hole in his back there? Wait, I need more. I need more hands. I need, like, assistance. Oh, my gosh. Look. It slotted in. <laughs> I could just wrap this round my head. This is, like, could just become part of my cosplay on the screen. On stream, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh shit, this is really looking epic, guys. It's really looking amazing. Okay, are we ready for his head? I am. Deal with it. Whoa. I don't know if you bought yourself a collector's edition, but if you didn't, you should have. I'm not gonna lie, this base is kind of lame. It needs lights on it, like, it needs lights to really look effective but Sephiroth is everything this figure is massive guys wait let me let me like stand a little do you see that do you see how big are you joking he looks perfect look at him yeah closer see what i'm saying guys like the base really isn't anything too special, but Sephiroth, like, getting it for Sephiroth is an absolute yes, a win, a whole win, because that is amazing. That is actually perfect. And his face is bang on. I'm so proud of you. I didn't even do anything, and I'm so proud of you. Where do I put it? Like, where do I? Okay, but, you know, it's like, it's so big. Where do I actually put you now? I'm gonna have to find a special place for you. I'm telling you now, this is so worth collector's edition money. FF16 statue compared to this is like, it's a joke. This is insane. The level of detail on every single part of him. Gosh, this is so beautiful, guys. This is so stunning. I'm so in awe. Like, I'm so happy. This is the beginning of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth for me. I am so happy. I can't... I can't explain. Oh, my gosh. This is just reminding me of my brother. If he was here, he would have been so happy. He visited not long ago. And he just missed the arrival of this by, like, a few days. But, um... This looks amazing. I can't wait for you to see it in person. Or Nissan, you're going to love it. It is so stunning. Oh, so beautiful. I need to make sure. Are there really no lights on here? I do need to make sure, guys. Let me have a look. Because it, it feels like a wasted opportunity. It really isn't. Oh, man. It really is a wasted opportunity, I promise you. Because having lights on here would have just set this off next level. Like, totally would have made it even more insane. Like, it is absolutely insane already. But, you know what I mean? Like, it would have been amazing. Yeah. He's beautiful. I'm so happy with it. <laughs> oh, just, I can't believe it. Guys, the attention to detail on this thing. For reference, guys, that's the FF16 Collector's Edition. Little statue thingy. This is Sephiroth. There is no comparison. This is phenomenal. This is everything. He ate, left no crumbs, devoured all of it. But this doesn't come close. Not even 5%. This is phenomenal, guys. The attention to detail is worth every single penny. <sighs> I really hope you guys are able to get your hands on one. Do you know what is missing? Genova's head. That's all. <laughs> That's all he's missing. He's just missing Genova's head. Like, he could have just been carrying it here. They probably thought of it. They're probably like, you know what? We're going to release another version of this statue. Charge $100 more. And add her head. Yeah. And lights. <laughs>
Because <laughs> I keep talking about lights. That would have been the one thing that could have taken this to like next, next level. Um, yeah, definitely it's beautiful. But lights on this, like at the bottom, can you imagine? Would have been insane. Insane. But this is so seriously epic. This has made, this has made my day so flipping much. I'm so happy, guys. Can more games, can especially more Square Enix games come with these kinds of collector's edition statues? This size of a character, absolutely. Like, yes, we need this size characters in collector's edition figures because this is insane. Square Enix popped off. Square Enix knows what they were doing. This is so beautiful. He's, in, he's just stunning. And the wing is like, yeah, this is like, I could just... Yeah, I could just use this as an umbrella. Go outside and be like, you know what, it's raining. I think I'm going to take my Sephiroth umbrella with me. <laughs> Shout on me from the rain. <laughs> Under his little wing. It is beautiful. It has literally made my day. Made my week. I'm so happy. And this is the perfect start to Effort 7 Rebirth. <sighs> Cloud, Eris, Tifa. Red 13, Barrett, the whole gang. Sephiroth, here we go again. It's going to be a crazy ride. I really have to think about where I'm going to put him because I'm not sure yet, but temporarily there he is above my shoulder. So for those of you that stick around, uh, yeah, I won't be able to play as many games um, or do as much on this channel as I did before. Um, I will definitely be uploading gameplay for the meanwhile, but um, that won't be as often because I do have a tiny little announcement to make. Are you ready? So I just invited player three into my life. He's really small, really cute, and he's my son. <laughs> I, I had a baby guys, and um, he's beautiful. He's amazing. He's everything I've, I, I, I couldn't even have dreamed, honestly. Um, He's just, he's everything. Uh, he's the center of my universe. And he, of course, rightfully takes up all of my attention, as he should uh, these days. And I'm solely focused on him. Um, and he's just like the cutest little Pokemon ever. I call him my little Pokemon because he is just the cutest little Pokemon ever. And I can't wait to introduce him into the gaming world. And like, he's going to be so so happy because i'll have all of the latest games all of the latest consoles everything and he'll just be like mom can we play this and i'll be like yeah i already got it duh <laughs> i've already like thought of everything but yeah guys i'm extremely happy um bay and i are over the moon um i'm the happiest little mom on the planet and uh life couldn't be more epic but like i said because of this awesome news and because he's around, I, you know, want to spend as much time with him and just be the best mom that I can be and be there for him as he grows and learns and does all the things. So I won't have as much time for this channel, but I do still love this channel. It is still very much an important part of me and everything I love about gaming and the gaming world. So you will see me here, just not probably on live streams most likely recorded gameplays that i can go and check in with him and be there for him as he needs me so um so yeah that's the news <laughs> i'm very happy guys i'm super happy um so yeah thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed the unboxing of final fantasy 7 rebirth it has been so like I can't explain like the being able to do this after such a long time means so much to me it's a happy little break from like the, the everyday routine and um it's just a joy to unbox anything Final Fantasy 7 related you guys know how much I love this game the gameplay itself when I actually get to it <laughs> in the game and playing it will be amazing and I can't wait. So thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Sign up.